na pania kufaidika na mafunzo ya ukulima wa kisasa ili kuongeza mazao wakati ambapo msimu wa kupanda umewadia shirika la kilimo la utafiti Calro linapania kuandaa siku mbili ya kutoa mafunzo kati ya tarehe 14 na 15 mwezi huu ambapo zaidi wa kulima moja watapokea mafunzo na kuwafunza wasio na ujuzi thabiti katika njia ya kisasa ya mafunzo mkurugenzi wa shirika la Calro Robert Musyoki amesema kuwa kongamano hilo pia litazindua aina mbalimbali mbali za mbegu amba ayo pia itasambazwa kwa bei nafuu baadhi ya mbegu zitakazo kupatikana kwa bei nafuu ni kama vile marage, po, pojo, mahindi, mchele, ngano na nyinginezo. The first one in 2022 we had about 1500 farmers coming. And uh, that's why now this time because many farmers are aware about the uh, this uh, event. Uh, many farmers have showed interest and we are targeting about 5000 uh, farmers to participate. The first one we had only 15 uh, participants in 2022 and uh, in 2023 we had about um, 70 farm uh, exhibitors but for now we are targeted to have 100 ex exhibitors and these exhibitors will be from various cadres in agriculture in the field of agriculture we are expecting Cairo to take the lead when it comes to technology um, uh, demonstration the innovation and technology that they have developed they will be here uh, showcasing all what they have developed over time and what uh, is aligned to air farmers to uplift uh, their productivity, their production in the farm. We have also other stakeholders in this, um, like Stack Seed Traders Association, also who have developed quite various types of uh, varieties that are adaptable and suitable in various agroecological zones uh, in the country. They will be here showcasing their varieties. They are showcasing how, not only the variety, but how you can um, plant a variety or a crop to get the maximum uh, benefit out of it. So various companies have confirmed they will be here for seed uh, to showcase uh, that, those varieties. Now,